Hello, friends. It's Thursday, August 6, 2009, and the Obama poster of him as the Joker has gone viral all over the United States and worldwide on the Internet. We've made some new ones at InfoWars.com that say Obama fascism, because he's more closely akin to a fascist. For every uh, $30 he steals for the banks, he does give $1 of chicken feed to the people. We also have some versions that say uh, socialism, you know, the classic one. And we have uh, versions that say Infowars.com and uh, versions uh, that say New World Order. We are asking our viewers, our listeners, all over the Internet, all over talk radio, whether you're liberal, conservative, you name it, who are wanting to stand up against Obama and all of his lies. And the fact that the establishment is using Obama to carry out their agenda. The establishment is trying to use his star appeal to sell the New World Order, the carbon tax, the government, health care, uh, the whole agenda. He's got to be stopped. He's got to be exposed. That's why we have posted a page up on Infowars.com that has free flyers. And you can print them in color. You can print them in black and white. Fascism, socialism, New World Order, Infowars.com. We're going to add a George Bush fascism one uh, up there as well. We've got T-shirts uh, that have this image on them. We're going to create one with Bush and Obama, but we've got the Obama ones up for now at Infowars.com. But regardless, the reason this message needs to get out, the reason we've decided to put out this emergency alert is the mainstream media, and we have all these articles listed up on Infowars.com, is saying it's racist to put Obama down and to lampoon him as the Joker. The very same magazine in New York that showed George Bush as a vampire attacking the Statue of Liberty, they're saying this is racist. The Joker is a psychopathic criminal genius, and we know Obama is a sociopathic criminal genius for foreign banks that have bipartisanly stolen $23.7 trillion, according to Bloomberg. This guy is a fraud and a hoax and a liar. He is a joker. He's laughing at us all the way to the bank. And so we're not going to give in to political correctness and intimidation. We're asking everybody to go print these flyers off Infowars.com, to plaster them all over your town, to not wait, to do it today. And we're also asking listeners to shoot a YouTube video of them putting up the Obama poster with Infowars.com under it, and the winner, whoever puts up the best video of plastering the most posters, will win $1,000 from Infowars.com. So we're launching this contest. Don't let them silence your free speech. Get out there and take action. I'm sending my crew out there to do it. I'm going to be doing it later today. Take action. Let's have a viral awakening. Now here's my great crew, Rob Dew and Jason Douglas, out there putting up some around town. Please do the same. My name is Jason, and I am going to make some poster adhesive. Ah! Next, we're going to try another technique with a staple gun. to use too many staples. Staples are your friend.
So where we're at is uh, a location where they have a, every first Thursday about 20,000 people are going to come out here. So that's why we're putting up the, the, the signs out here because we know they're going to have an immediate impact tonight. The most important point is this. There is a revolution of awakening to the private Federal Reserve, to the fact that both political parties are just bought and paid for. Here in Austin and around the country, congressmen and women are being shouted down by their constituents on cap and trade, the government health care, open borders, the wars, uh, the, the, the banker bailout mainly. And the media for the last week has been saying, it's not real, everybody agrees with the government, these are hired lobbyists. Now ABC News and others are admitting, no, it's, it's, it's not staged, it's real. Obama's being shouted and booed down uh, when he's in Arkansas. It's happening to Republicans. Senator Cornyn gets booed off the stage at Tea Parties by conservatives and libertarians. The people are universally angry. Congress has an 11% approval rating. Obama's approval rating has gone from the mid-80s to the mid-40s now, the lowest of any U.S. president in his first administration, six, seven months into his term, lower than George Bush, lower than Jimmy Carter. We need to get even more aggressive and shatter this illusion that we're all alone. The people have to get out and interface with each other so that we all see that we're the majority, so we can stop the globalists and their different operations. And this Obama Joker image is the way to go, one of many ways to go, because they're trying to censor it, they're scared of it, it shatters the sweet loving image and really shows something closer to what he has really done politically. Uh, and it makes people stop trusting him. They already don't trust him, but it, it, it manifests it all so simply. So listen, if everybody goes out and prints the flyers and posters off InfoWars.com and makes color copies or black and white copies and gets them out everywhere, it is going to be explosively big. It is going to be so neat. And the media is going to panic even more because they're trying to intimidate everybody, saying it's racist. It's wrong to put this up. But it was okay to show George Bush as the Joker. We found out that, that had been done. It was okay to show him as a vampire. And it is okay. That's your right as an American. Love your country. Fear your government. As Teddy Roosevelt said, the greatest form of patriotism. But they're trying to bring in this hyper-political correctness to restrict free speech. They're trying to pass hate crimes laws to restrict free speech. Now is the time to take action. So $1,000 prize. Uh, the contest runs until not this Friday, but next Friday. So you got a week and a half to get this done. Shoot the best video of whoever puts up the most posters in the most public places. You win the thousand dollars. But all of us, but all of us win liberty and freedom. All of us get to let Big Brother know we're angry. We're sending a signal to them to get off our back, stop raping, and stop the tyranny. The posters are on Infowars.com, or you can get the T-shirts also at Infowars.com. Whatever you do, get them out to everybody. God bless you. One more thing. Take action. Let's have a viral awakening.